Every living cell is wrapped in a fascinating structure, the cell membrane. But scientists didn't always know its exact design. Over the years, several models have been proposed to explain its structure. Today, I'm diving into the key models of the cell membrane and how our understanding evolved. In 1935, Hugh Danielli and James Davison proposed the sandwich model. They imagined the cell membrane as a lipid bilayer sandwiched between two layers of proteins, like a protein-lipid protein sandwich. It explained selective permeability, but ignored the dynamic nature of membranes. In the 1950s, J.D. Robertson studied membranes under an electron microscope. He proposed the unit membrane model, stating that all biological membranes share the same trilaminar structure two dark protein layers and a light lipid layer in between. In 1972, S.J. Singer and Garth Nicholson introduced the fluid mosaic model, which is still accepted today. It describes the membrane as a fluid lipid bilayer with proteins embedded like tiles in a mosaic. This model explains flexibility, self-healing, and active transport. From the rigid sandwich model to the dynamic fluid mosaic, each model brought us closer to understanding how membranes control the life of a cell. Cell membranes are more than just barriers. They are dynamic gateways of life. Keep exploring, because biology always has more layers to uncover. If you found this useful, hit like, share and subscribe to learn the logic behind every biological concept.